and welcome to another intuitive movement practice with us here at ReleaseWorks. Thanks so much for joining us today. Uh, today we're going to, to work with a chair and do some intuitive movement from there. Uh, so just as always, take some, some time to set your space. Find a quiet corner of your home. Find a nice sturdy chair, preferably without handles without the armrests but with a back and maybe dim the lights light a few candles you might even set up a pillow next to you to use throughout your practice and once you're there let's just get started in a wide leg forward fold so sitting back in your chair bringing your knees out wide Holding forward and down and finding some, some ease here. Start to connect with your breath. Lengthen your inhales and your exhales. Maybe even take a few of those exhales as a sigh out of your mouth. Close your eyes if you haven't already. And settle in. Nowhere better to be, nothing better to do. ahead and close your lips and start to breathe exclusively through your nose. Bringing your awareness, your attention to that space just beneath the tip of your nose and just above your upper lip. Feeling your breath as it passes through this space. And keeping your eyes closed, just find a little bit of intuitive movement. Maybe wiggle through your fingers or your toes. Maybe round through your shoulders and through your neck. The next place we'll go, placing your hands either on your ankles or right above your knees. Keeping your hips hinged in your fold, but lifting your head and your chest towards the ceiling, arching through your back. Lengthen and arch through your spine. Good. And breathe here. Let it feel good. Maybe find a little intuitive movement here, rocking a little side to side, rolling through head and neck. On your next exhale, just fold forward and down once again. Notice, is it any different? Is it easier? Is it harder? What came up? From here, keeping your left hand more or less where it is, bring your right arm back and up for a twist, letting your chin follow that arm. Exhale to bring your right arm forward and down. 
and inhale, other side. Take a few of these on your own, at your own pace, pausing in areas of stuckness. Feeling through. There's no right or wrong here. Just let it be easy. Let it feel good. Remember to stay connected with your breath. Next couple of breaths, just make your way back to forward fold. No rush to get there. When you do, reconnect with your breath. Notice how you feel. On an inhale, place your hands on your thighs, just above your knees. From here, go ahead and press into your hands and your arms. Lift your chest, lift your chin, arch through your lower spine. Doing a modified cat cow in a chair. Keep your hips seated back. And exhale to round forward and down. Tuck your chin, round your spine, tuck your tail, fold in. Inhale, lift and arch, and exhale, round and tuck. Keep going at your own pace here. Let it feel good. Add in or take away whatever you need. And next five to ten breaths, come back to a neutral spine. Go ahead and let your forearms rest on your thighs. Let your hips sit back. And from your elbows, press into your arms to lift and open your chest, arch your back, and look up for a modified Sphinx pose. See if you can find some ease in your body here. What can you breathe into? What can you soften? What's working too hard? I'm gonna 
be here for a moment. So maybe wiggle and find a space where you can sink and settle in. Once you do, make a commitment to stillness. Bring your awareness back to your breath. moving a muscle, just reconnect with your breath, and as you do, start to wiggle fingers and toes, find a little bit of intuitive movement. Then, when you're ready, come back up to a tall seat. Here, go ahead and scoot forward on your chair just a bit. And inhale your arms out, around, and up towards the ceiling. On an exhale, bring your left arm to your left side. Let your right arm arch over to your left side. For a side bend. Inhale to come back up to center and exhale other side. You might even grab onto the leg of the chair to assist in your stretch. Inhale, come back up. Take a few more of these on your own. couple of breaths, come back up, hands, arms out around and up, gaze up, maybe even arch through your back like you're trying to point and or look behind you for a back bend. For some of you this might feel a little nicer scoot a, if you scoot back on your chair and let the back of the chair support you. You can bend into it just a bit more. There you go. On your next inhale, come back up. Let your arms fall to your sides. We're going into some spinal twists. Next inhale, Bring your left arm back behind you and hook it on the outside of your chair. Let your right arm come to the outside of your left knee and look over 
your left shoulder for a twist. Inhale to center and exhale, twist to the other side. Hooking your right arm behind your chair, left arm outside of right knee. Look over your right shoulder. Inhale to center and take a few more of these on your own. At your own pace, adding or taking away whatever serves you best today. Your next five to ten breaths come back to center. Find some intuitive movement here. It doesn't matter what it looks like. Move and stretch and feel into those places that have been aching. You'll know what they are. Trust what you feel. Now, when you're ready, scoot till you're about halfway on your seat. Bring your feet more or less hip width distance apart, ankles more or less under your knees. We're going to start with finding your sits bones. So the bony part of your pelvis that you sit on, bony part of your glutes, if you feel the weight of those into your chair, you notice in it where more, more of your weight is. Do you feel more on your right, more on your left? And now, if you were to picture or imagine your pelvis like a bowl full of water, from this place, can you tilt your pelvis forward in a way that the water would spill forward out in front of you? And on an exhale, tilt that bowl back so the water would spill behind you. Inhale forward. And exhale back. Start to slow that down. Exaggerate that movement. Soften through your upper body where you can. Start to notice where you feel tallest in that transition from forward to back. 
where posture, where sitting up is easy, the least amount of effort. The next time you find that spot, stay there. Soften on top of that. want to open your eyes here. We're going to do a modified squat. Essentially getting up out of your seat and sitting back into it. So keeping your feet again more or less hip width distance apart, ankles more or less under your knees. Place your hands on your thighs and inhale to stand up. See if you can slow it down Use your glutes, use your hamstrings, all the way to standing, and exhale, slowly sit back down, slow and controlled. There you go. Do that a few more times on your own. See if you can slow it down even further. See what you notice. You may try it with your eyes closed for a bit more of a challenge. One or two more here. Next time you find yourself in the seat, take a moment to reconnect and find some intuitive movement. Close your eyes. Bring your awareness back to your breath, that space just beneath the tip of your nose, just above your upper lip. Going to start to move into some longer holds. So you can stay about halfway forward on your chair. Let's keep left knee bent, left foot planted, and just lengthen out your right leg in front of you. Now this might be a great time to grab a pillow and place this on your lap. And from here, Go ahead and inhale your spine long. Lift up towards the ceiling. And exhale to fold forward and down over your extended leg. You may need to keep a bit of a bend in your knee and that's okay. It may feel good to explore rotating your leg out or in, finding a place that feels the most in need today. Once you find that, make a commitment to stillness. Close your eyes and settle in. Notice where your mind goes in the silence, in the stillness. Notice what comes up without judging or fixing or needing to do anything with it.
muscle start to connect with your breath. As you do, start to find a little wiggle in your toes and your fingers. Start to find or make your way back up to a seat. Let it flow, let it feel good, let it be easy. Bring your right foot back. Find a little bit of movement and eventually we'll get to the other side. So when you're ready, keep your right knee bent, right foot planted, lengthen your left leg out in front of you. Just like before, explore with your knee bent slightly, possibly turn your leg out or in to find the right stretch for you. And when you're ready, inhale your spine long, lift up towards the ceiling. And then exhale, fold forward and down. Making any minor adjustments that you need. Eventually, making a commitment to stillness and settling in. Moving a muscle, just start to reconnect with your breath. And start to find a little wiggle in your fingers and toes and make your way back up to a seat. Bring your left foot back, find some movement. Maybe find a few more cat cows, round and arch through your spine. Find your way back to neutral spine. The next place we'll go is keeping your right leg more or less how it is, foot planted, knee bent. Bring your left ankle to rest on your right thigh for a figure four. From here, inhale your spine long. Lift up towards the ceiling and exhale, fold forward and down. This would be a great place for a pillow. Once you make any minor adjustments that you need, Settle into stillness.
next inhale, start to find little movements and eventually make your way back up to a seat. Gently and slowly bring your left foot back to the ground. Take any movements you need here before setting up the other side. And when you're ready, right ankle over left thigh. Inhale your spine long and exhale, fold forward and down. Next inhale, start to find some little movements and eventually let them lead you back up to a seat. Gently and slowly place your right foot back on the ground. Take a minute or two to Find whatever last movements your body needs today. Eventually, bring yourself to a comfortable seat. This might mean scooting back in the chair until you find the support of the backrest. You might be comfortable right where you are. Wiggle through your hips to find your tallest point so you can settle all the way in to your pelvis and to your sits bones. Ground your feet down into the earth. If they aren't already, go ahead and close your eyes. Reconnect with your breath for a bit of seated meditation. It might feel good here to keep your hands on your thighs or even turn them upright. Whatever that is for you, settle in.
Success is not final. Failure is not fatal. It's the courage to continue that counts. Go ahead and bring your left hand to your heart, your right hand to your belly. We'll take a few last cleansing breaths together. On your next inhale, fill up deeply through your abdomen, through your diaphragm, through your ribs and chest, and a little bit more in at the top. And exhale with a sigh out of your mouth. Good. Now let's take one more together. Even bigger. Inhale through your belly, through your diaphragm, through your chest. Sip in a little more air at the top and hold. And exhale. Thank you so much for joining us today for our intuitive movement practice here with Release Works. We would love to hear how your practice went and please let us know if you have any questions. Looking forward to seeing, seeing you next time.